This may sound funny, but I want to give my take on the Barbie movie. Now, I took the film as a satire on both feminism and on the men's movement. I also took it as a satire on both the patriarchy, so-called, and the matriarchy, so-called. It also showed people waking up from all the fakery. Now, the irony of the feminist movement is that it's really a criticism of feminine virtue. It demonizes femininity. It's the narrative, ironically, according to feminism, apparently women need to become more like men because the so-called patriarchy has denied them this power. The so-called women's movement has ironically become an anti-women's movement. The Barbie movie, in my opinion, touches on this. It's the cognitive dissonance of being a woman that's highlighted in the subplot of the human world, the mother and the daughter in the film. It shows all the conflicting narratives that women face these days. They need a good man, but they should also be in conflict with men. They need to be career women, but they also need to be empathetic and good listeners. They need to be strong, but not too strong. Uh, there's something that's framed these days as ancient feminism, although I wouldn't personally call it feminism. It actually embodies what modern feminists try to achieve. And it does this without destroying femininity, without demonizing men as well. It's what's known as states womanhood. It's the tradition of the inner strength and wisdom of ancient women, the foremothers, 